Originally, my plan for this video was to take the camera outside and to do this whole thing outside and get a little change of scenery and shake things up a bit, but <laughs> Mother Nature decided to shake things up a bit. There is basically a storm happening out. There's like flood warnings, like things are happening. The planet is, I don't know. So, you guys are just gonna have to deal with, um, I wanted to bring you all here today to talk about a platform that is near and dear to my heart, and that is Twitter. Every time that I talk about Twitter IRL, everybody is like, what? Twitter? Do people use that? Yes, people do use it. And guess what? Twitter is my country. I love Twitter, and you should too, and here's why. First of all, the bad word, networking. Twitter is this amazing place to network, to make new friends, for collaborations, to meet colleagues. It is not super oversaturated like Instagram is. A lot of people be sending DMs over on Instagram to get in contact with certain people. If you head over to Twitter, you might be surprised to see that that same person is a little bit more accessible because not as many people are there trying to I don't know, slide in their DMs. In order to network properly on Twitter, you really need to just have a conversation with the people that you are following or the people who follow you as well. Twitter really is like going to a party or a get together and just hanging out with people. So if you kind of think of it that way and treat it that way, then you will use Twitter properly in order to network and get to know certain people on the platform. Next, you need to familiarize yourself with GIFs or GIFs, whatever whatever planet you live on. Anyway, this video is not about GIF versus GIF. It's GIF, by the way. Using GIFs in the right way can help you communicate your message in a more succinct manner. I don't need to school you on how to use GIFs on the internet, but I don't know, maybe I do. <laughs> on Twitter, GIFs are your friends. 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 Take Twitter from URL to IRL. If you connect with someone on Twitter, don't be afraid to turn that into a real life encounter, especially if it's someone who is in the same industry as you or maybe an artist that you can collaborate with. Twitter is there for the reason of connecting with people. So if you find someone that you connect with, try to see how you can uh, connect with them offline. And for those of you who do follow me on Twitter, you probably already know that I am hosting a micro conference that is specific about Twitter. The purpose of this micro conference is one, to learn about the platform and the proper ways and strategies to use Twitter, and two, to network. So I am actually going to turn my URL connections into IRL. This uh, micro conference is called Twit IRL. <laughs> the conference is going to be on June 8th in Atlanta, Georgia. So if you want more information, I'm gonna put a link to to how to get your tickets and RCP and all that stuff in the description. Even if you aren't that active on Twitter or maybe you aren't even on the platform, I still urge you to go because this could be a really great networking opportunity. You can meet some other creators, entrepreneurs, people who are interested in the same things that you are, and maybe we might even uh, make you a little Twitter a little Twitter profile so that you can join us. This next tip is a little bit more on the technical side. I feel like it's important because it's kind of like a little pet peeve of mine. I see it all the time and I'm surprised that people still don't know that that this happens. If you are making a tweet and you want to mention somebody, don't start the tweet with their handle. So if you start the tweet with at Red Gromina is super amazing, your followers are not going to see that tweet. Only the people who follow both you and 
whoever you're mentioning, at Road Romina, only those people are going to see that tweet. Two ways to avoid this is put a little punctuation mark, whatever, at the start of the sentence so that it doesn't start off with the handle. You can also start off the sentence by saying, hey, did you know that at Red Romina is awesome? And that will avoid, you know, this fiasco. So many times I've had people who will say something nice about another creator or somebody that they look up to without realizing that nobody can see <laughs> what they just said um, because, you know, they don't follow the other person. So if you want somebody to be discovered, if you want to talk about a musician that you love, then uh, th th don't start off the tweet with, you know, with their handle because then ain't nobody going to see it. Another little technical tip is if you're going to use hashtags, use them sparingly. <laughs> I feel like this is kind of like a rule just across the board on social media, but if you have a sentence, don't hashtag random words. That seems to be a thing that people do. If you are just writing a sentence like, my hashtag cat is hashtag amazing and loves hashtag watching TV, uh, then we got a problem. Write out your sentence normal. If there's a few keywords that you think people will search for and will want to see your tweet in those search results, uh, then add those hashtags at the end if possible. I mean, I could go on and on with all of like these technical tips, but I this, this video is not about that. This video is about how you are missing out on the opportunity to be on an amazing platform. So many opportunities have come to me because of Twitter. So if you remember, or if you are new here and have no idea, I did a speaking thing. I spoke at 368 in New York City. That opportunity happened because of Twitter, solely because of Twitter. That being said, if you are sitting if you are sitting around waiting for opportunities to happen, let me break it to you. You should hop on that Twitter train. By the way, I hang out there all of the time. Basically, if you wanna hang out with me like 24 seven, although I don't know why anybody would wanna do that, Twitter, Twitter is the place to do that. So stop sleeping and uh, go join that Twitter game. Honestly, guys, you're missing out. You gotta get on Twitter. Anyway, for now, I am gonna go probably <laughs> to hang out on Twitter. Anyway, that is really, that that is the end. That's the end of that. If you can do me a huge favor and hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. If you enjoyed this video, then don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I will see you when I see you. Bye. This video was made possible by my patrons over at patreon.com slash If you like what I do, become a patron and be a part of the exploration.